Okay, final question here. Um, what do you see as the main differences between creative and linear people? When you're talking about like getting into a negotiation with, say, an engineer who is used to that check, 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 and move on. Um, Are these how, real questions? <laughs> yeah. yeah. How, any thoughts on, on adapting yourself to them, getting them to adapt to you, and how do you meet in the middle with them? Um, it's going to be probably easier for you to adapt because I think creative people are probably more adaptive. That's my prejudice. Um, I, think, I think most creative people can be linear. A lot of linear people can't be creative. It's just how we're wired. I think it comes in our DNA, and I think you can uh, exercise it or not. But you have to find a common language. And so if it's an engineer, learn some of those terms before you go in there so that you're speaking their language. Uh, again, it's preparation, because they're not going to be able to speak yours. If you start talking about what version of InDesign or Adobe you're using or how Creative Suites interfaces with something else, they don't know. So, so you have to have their language, not yours.